Hey everybody, this is Midnight Update. I am Seamus Byrne. Welcome to Wednesday, 11th of February. In the fight to restore some civilization to the ravaged Victorian countryside, I wanted to give a shout out to some unsung heroes. Telco staff have been working hard to restore services to affected areas, even riding with fire engines to get into still troubled regions. Phones really can be a lifeline, so all the best to the crews from Telstra Optus and Vodafone who are out there. Free phones and even simply new phone chargers are also being distributed and pay phones are being set to free call modes. In product news, local PC builder Alltech Computers has announced some tiny new Atom 330 based PCs. The SysArial Atom systems are mirror finished boxes with 2 gigs of RAM and 250 gig hard drives and Vista. The $599 DV02 has a PCI slot available, while the $679 DP04 is extra tiny at 7 by 18.5 by 24.5 centimeters. The Atom 330 is the new dual core version of Atom, so it will be interesting to see how these budget systems perform. I'm hoping to get hands on with these very soon. Bacardi has launched Be Live Share, a music download site with some free and exclusive new tracks from Groove Armada. Your first MP3 is free, then the cost is inviting friends to share in the Be Live site experience. More friends earns you more free tracks, and the person who builds the biggest network gets invited along on the Bacardi Express 2 day slash 4 gig tour in March. If that sounds like your bag, it's linked up at midnightupdate.com. Channel 9's showing some brains in the face of the BitTorrent onslaught, offering legal downloads of the new underbelly that they have also sanctioned for redistribution. The files are attached to a special hero video player and will expire at the conclusion of the new series. But by making it easy to catch up on the show, they're removing some of the wind from the sails of piracy. A touch of good thinking, perhaps? But just when it was going so well, Nine also announces they are delaying the launch of their second SD channel until around July due to technical reasons. Guys, you need every weapon you can get to fight both online distribution and Foxtel. You do not have much time. Did you not get the memo that said you could run new channels from January 1st this year? Too busy branding Freeview, were we? Mmm, that's working out great so far. Finally, two great geek videos to share tonight. The first is from ZDNet Australia, who hit the streets to ask punters what they think of Windows 7. Except it wasn't Windows, it was actually KDE 4. Touché ZD. The second is from The Onion, which is always flowing with rivers of comedy gold. Their latest tech slam is called Sony releases new stupid piece of that doesn't work. Full versions of both are linked up at midnightupdate.com. Don't forget to send your comments, thoughts, suggestions or questions to heyshay at midnightupdate.com. Each Monday I'll pick a letter of the week to receive the joy of prizes. This week, a Plantronics Audio 365 gaming headset. I reviewed this when I was still at Gizmodo and rated it a very nice budget alternative to the awesome Steel Sound 5H V2s. A link to that review is now up at midnightupdate.com. That's all for tonight's update. Thanks for stopping by. You can join us weeknights around midnight Sydney time for daily geek news. And for more coverage, visit midnightupdate.com.